Hello, this is Extreme Tricks here, and today I'm going to be doing a Brazil squad builder. Um, this is a squad builder, it's worth around 260k. So, um, let's get started. So, in this, first off, we have got Diego Alves, possibly my favourite keeper in this entire game. He's 82 rated, plays for Valencia and he plays for and he comes from Brazil. Let's look at his stats. As you can see 91 diving which is brilliant. 72 handling, 74 kicking, 90 reflexes, 57 speed and 75 positioning. Um he only cost me 2900 coins. Um, he's six foot two. He's left footed. He's got two star weak foot, one star skill moves. So yeah, he's really good. Now before I go on, I would just like to say, um, my friend, the R Gamer three sixty, made a video about top three bargain buy goalkeepers. So if you want to go and check that out, and then you find three top class keepers that are also really really cheap. So next off we're going to go with our right back and that is Mykon, the Manchester City midf uh, midfielder, uh, right back. He's got 85 pace which is really fast for a right back but as you'll see in this team all over the, the um, pitch there is pace. He's got 75 shooting which is decent for a right back, 82 passing which is also really good for a right back. 80 dribbling, again really good for a right back, but he's not like Danny Alves where he doesn't have the best of defence stats. He does have good defence stats, 82 defending, 77 heading, so those are really good stats. Um, he costs around 40k for right footed, 3 star weak foot, 3 star skill moves, and um, he's right footed, 6 foot, so he can definitely get up for those headers. So next up we've got Marcelo. The only really player that I was going to pick for here. Now Marcelo plays for Real Madrid and so let's look at his stats. 83 pace again really quick. S sorry. Sorry about that. Um, 67 shooting, 80 passing, 83 dribbling 80 defending and 70 heading. Now the reason he's only got 70 heading is because he isn't that tall. He's only 5 foot 8 so he doesn't really get up for those headers. He costs 22,250 coins which is quite good for a defender of his quality. He's free star weak foot, free star skimmers and he's left footed. So next up are centre backs. Um, we have got a very special centre back. We've got Team of the Season Rivera, and we have got Diddy. So let's look at Team of the Season Rivera stats. He's got 68 pace, 65 shooting, 65 passing, 62 um, dribbling. But look at those defending stats: 86 defending, 84 heading, and he's just really, really good. 84 rated. Now, his normal card is about 79 rated, I think. It cost me 41,250 coins, which is good for a team of the season. And um, he's 6 foot 4, so you can definitely get those headers when you, when you swing them into the box. Um, 3 star weak foot, 2 star skill moves, so he's alright skill wise. Dede, one of my favourite defenders, because he's got 81 pace, so again, he's quite quick. 49 shooting, pretty poor, but he's a centre back, so it doesn't really matter. 70 passing, which is good. 79. Oh, who? Um, sorry about that again. 67 dribbling, 51 defending, and 80. 51. 81 defending, and 82 heading. It could only cost 3,200 coins, so he really is a good player for that. Sorry, I'm stumbling on my words today, so um 
he only costs three thousand two hundred coins, so it's really cheap for a defender of his quality. And he's only got two star weak foot, two star skill moves. It's fine for a centre back, and he's six foot four, so he can definitely get up for those headers. So next up in the centre centre mid position, we have got Ramirez. And they probably saw the other two centre mids, which are Coutinho, and the other centre mid is Lucas. So let's start off with Ramirez. 88 pace, so he's really quick. 68 shooting, a little bit poor for a centre mid, um, but it doesn't seem like it. 79 passing um, is okay for a centre mid. I prefer it to be in the 80s. 82 dribbling, really good. 76 defending and 72 heading. Um, so I wouldn't really play him in a CDM or I'd play him a cam. I think CMs is usual position. Played for Chelsea, 81 rated. 5,300, I think it's a little bit expensive. But he's three star weak foot, three star skill moves. He's only 5 foot 11, so he's not really going to get up for that many headers. And he's right footed. Now this is a player that I hate, um, I don't hate him, well, I'm a United fan, I don't really like saying this, but Coutinho, he's an outstanding player, should be having 82 pace, 67 shooting, a little bit poor, um, so I'm a, he's a little bit of a let down in that position, 74 passing, again, not the best, but that 92 dribbling is outstanding. You don't see many players with that. I think Messi's only got 94, 95 dribbling. Or not not even that. I'm not too sure. But he's got 42 defending, 49 heading. It's not the best stats. 78 raid. Probably should be more. But he's only 5 foot 7. So can't blame him. He's 11k. I wouldn't say he's worth that. He's probably cheaper in a cam. I didn't convert him, I just bought him off the market as a CM. So, I said, first I wait for the first skillers, which is really good. Uh, and next up, we've got Lucas. Very pacey, 92 pace. And I think he is the fastest player in this whole team. 77 shooting. A little bit of a letdown again. 78 passing, which is half decent. 88 dribbling, again, fantastic. 53 defending, 50. And 54 heading. That is actually surprisingly good. Uh, he recently transferred from San Paolo to PSG in January, so this card's a little bit more expensive, but a key more expensive than his um, PSG card, which I've got here. He's 10.500k for a freestyle weight for freestyle skimmers. And again, why he's heading so low is because he's only 5 foot 8. So next up at right wing, we have got Hulk. Plays for Zenit, it's Petersburg. Nin 90 pace, 85 shooting, real, two real good stats. 78 passing, which is okay. 82 dribbling, which is really good. 60 defending and 74 heading. This guy is a really good player. And I really do like him. He's three and three point seven k, three thousand seven hundred coins. So he's quite good. He's only five foot eleven, um, which surprised me. But let down here is two star weak foot. So when he's on his right foot, he isn't very good with it. Four star skill moves, which is okay. So, uh, no, sorry, four star skill moves. Yeah. So, left wing. Bit obvious here, but it's Neymar. What a player. 91 pace, 79 shooting, which is a little bit disappointing, but that 91 pace really does make up for it. 74 passing again, a little bit disappointing, but 91 dribbling. That is just amazing. Now I'm thinking, what about Coutinho? I think it's Coutinho or Cortino, something like that. But, um,. It's just something about Neymar, that pace and his skill and everything. He's only got 44 defending, 59 heading. Not that important, to be honest. 
74 k he's dropped really much price but that's four star weak foot four star skill moves that five star skill moves sorry that really kind of makes him that bit better than Cortinio. so up front we've got a surprising choice here we've got the man of the match dual card 77 pace 80 shooting 85 passing that 80 shooting is really good because in game stats he's actually got 88 finishing so he's really good finishing 77 dribbling 44 defending and 80 heading he's 78 rated I wouldn't really say he's that low rated 22k for a man in the match card you really can't go wrong there 3 star weak foot 3 star skill moves what a player I really do like him I do prefer him over Pato personally um, so this is the team here, it, again it costs 260k, now I want to just tell you, the reason I didn't use Thiago Silva or Pato is because I saw this Mario Match Reaver card, one is just as good as Thiago Silva and he's a lot cheaper, so for you can put Thiago Silva in there, but I really wanted to try this team this season guy. And um, he's not from the BPL one that came out on Wednesday there. Came out last Wednesday, so he's, n he's relatively new. But, um, yeah, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye.